resume building a very important exercise that you must keep in mind now these days while going through some of the resumes i found that students mention appeared twice in upsc mains qualified three times upsc prelims do you think is it a right qualification to mention in your resume rather than mentioning that you are a bachelor's you are a master's students putting their career on stake immediately after their bachelor's diving into for upsc through various institutes joining those institutes with lakhs of amounts in hand and then towards the end of 3 years 4 years later in their life they have this to write on your resume so make sure you are writing a right content on resume and you are not spoiling your resume for name sake make sure you have continuity throughout your studies so always ensure that there is no break here if there is a single break here you would always have a question mark on resume you would be always asked why was this gap here even if your percentages are not consistent i'm not saying that percentage should be very high or good excellent but whatever your score is it should be either consistent or upward if that's not the scenario what would happen again you have a big question mark on your resume why this happened and that answering that why becomes extremely important when you are being interviewed through various companies so make sure you have a good resume a sound resume you don't have unnecessary break years gap years or um, uh, mentioning that you qualified the prelims or the uh, the elementary introductory stage of this competitive exam examination that's 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 definitely a good achievement but that's something that you cannot actually boost your resume with so make sure what to write on your resume and definitely that would matter a lot for your recruitments